Hi, and welcome back to Ava's Apple Tree. I am Rebecca, and we are doing a little video series of um, good gift giving ideas. Uh, today we're going to do uh, two to four, and uh, we've you can search back, and we've gone all through the ages um, before that. So today we're talking about t uh, ages two to four. At about uh, age two to three, kiddos are doing a little bit of what's called parallel play, and they're playing next to each other, but they're not necessarily playing with each other. And at about uh, age uh, three to four, um, they're starting to play with each other and sort of getting into imagination play even more with their peers. Um, some of the things that they're also doing is they're starting to mimic what we're doing um, as adults. So if uh, dad really likes cooking in the kitchen, then they're gonna start playing with things and pretending they're pots and pans. And we've got some really great enamel pots with some really great uh, utensils. Papoose has a, a line of vegetables and fruits. We've got strawberries here and avocado. There's a banana where the banana actually pops out. And then Ertzi has um, some kits as well. So this happens to be the vegetable kit, but we also have, there's fruit a fruit kit and a sweets kit. Uh, we've got the birthday muffins here. So they're really starting to engage in doing what we're doing. That includes cleaning. So we can start at an early age. This is actually functional um, as, a, as a dustpan and, dust, uh, and duster. So that's um, really to really encourage like, let's do this together. And then we also have these really great uh, wooden tool sets um, and constructor so they we have different all sorts of different combinations this is a set of five tools this is a constructor set and the bolts and the nuts go together you can put together the panels with those and we also have this really great play-doh set so it comes with all sorts of tools rollers hammers there's a couple mats here um, to help with like really getting their hands um, with their dexterity. Now, uh, imagination play again. We've got these papoose houses. This happens to be the strawberry house. Uh, papoose also has a pumpkin house and an oak house. And another thing that we can do is start celebrating with, um, they start really recognizing what celebration is. And we have uh, these Grimm's birthday rings. And the Grimm's birthday rings are specifically for birthdays. Um, but I also really like to use them for uh, marking the seasons. So pretty soon we'll be, uh, I'll be having mine set up for uh, the winter season. So on solstice, I'll have one set up um, and spring um, on all the, the equinox, etc. And as well as I also mark the minor holidays like Valentine's Day and Halloween. Um, I just I had one set up. Uh, I have a six-year-old who loves doing that. Um, and one uh, puzzles are also another really thing that they're really starting to get to. So we've got um, the Villac puzzles. They uh, this one happens to be two plus. Um, they're all rated for age. Along with the Atelier Fisher puzzles, this one happens to be the whale puzzle. Um, this one is a twelve-piece. They come in nine and and bigger this is the uh, four piece cube puzzle so each side of the cube you mix up and make into the puzzle um, and closer to four the memory game is really great so you flip the tiles and then you have to remember so um, kiddos are really starting to get uh, the memory working and really remembering and they will remember everything um, and then tell a stranger about some embarrassing moment that you have um, and then also we're still continuing to build up with um, the matching and recognizing colors. Uh, so the balls are really great. Kids are still enjoying putting things in. And then what's nice about this, this is the grappet set with two bowls and balls. Um, then you can hide them. They're also, kids will also use these as like cooking utensils. And with the balls at this age, um, ball runs are becoming really um, something that is interesting, sort of a cause and effect. And that's something that you can build with the Grimm's rainbow, uh, the Grimm's semicircles and the Grimm's uh, boards.
So that was a simple one, but you can get really complicated. You can find some videos on YouTube and they're really, really fun. So thank you for joining me um, and happy holidays. Bye.